สวัสดีค่ะวันนี้นะคะจะพามาชมวิธีการทำลามบอน It's a s a what you call is original local food for the northern part of Thailand. t h a n a So today my dad's going in to be a cook. Yeah, it, this is authentic. Authentic. Thai <laughs> Thai village cookie. Yeah, Nan. I'm from the Mun Tawat Nan. Yeah, and this is stuff that is brought straight out of the hills. The fields, the gardens, whatever, and you're making a meal out of this thing. This is my dad today. Okay, this is a what you call lemon grass. Lemon grass. My dad's gonna make a chili p a n So you're taking the bottom end of the lemon grass and cutting it. And uh, this is sea salt. Yeah, it's a it's like a crystal salt. It's a sea salt. Sea salt. Yeah. This. It's a uh, ingredient is we call m a k w a n It's a uh, hot and spicy okay. and give you a very good smell. Okay. The curfew. The curfew. Oh yeah. And this is. The curfew. Put some garlic in there. Make a tiam. Garlic. And skin and all. And then. We smash it. The everything in here is bamboo. It's bamboo. Yeah. So you will take all this stuff in there. Okay. And one of the things about Thai cooking is that nothing is measured. Everything is a guesstimate. No. Yes. <laughs> you just grab some and throw <laughs> it in there. But me so g a t what? Put it. Give it. Give it. Put it. Tam. Na ni le mung ga. Put it. Ga ao mung ga. Ao ao ga ao. Poli man the e. Tha ja ao kiem ga tong sai kiem. Pe ang na. Ah. Kiem ngao ro ya. Ngao ya chai kiem na. Sai kiem pe tam. Ti hong tom man. Tom man tam. So he just do by getting used to it. Right, that's what it said. He said uh, one thing that be careful with the uh, salt. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I know. And uh, chili. Right, but my point is, is that everywhere you go, everybody just grabs a little bit, this and the other, throws it in. Too much is not good. A little bit is not good. Also, it needs to be balanced. Yeah, I know, but I'm saying they do it so often that everything is just yeah, that looks about right. Okay. And now you have some dry chili. Put the chili. How many you put? Like, I, I, I have it on here, about a handful. s a l t y fish. That was in the too. Yeah. Oh. So all the thing here is just herb. Everything is an herb. Buffalo skin. Yep. Buffalo toenails. <laughs> oh, skin. Skin. Wow. This stuff skin here ha. takes a lot of work. It takes a lot of pounding. It takes. It's just labor intensive, but it is very good. You spend it like this. It get all the human. The s a m come out. He said. He said if the way to look at on this, if it's so red around here. Uh, it has poison. It make you itchy. Oh. You need to see that it's all no, or the no. same green or white. He said, if the white like this, you can eat. No, but but sometimes it have red, pink, something like that. Yeah. It make you itchy. Okay. I don't know what the guy calls. It look like this. And if you, oh yeah, it's kind of like a water lily. Can I buy it? Do you wanna? Look like a lotus leaf. Hmm. Mm. And then, my dad will put the bond. So what? It's called bond. Okay. Jane bond. The Jane bond. Put it in there, and he used that sauce. And he make this for make the other ingredients can cook, can mix. 
So it can be chopped a little bit. Don't tie it. Why? No, it's not a yak. 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 Filled with those leaves. How far? 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 How เออเขาเขามาใส่ที่หลังจีนี่ขยะจะอี้เรามาเดียวนี่นะไม่หายยากไม่บอกไม่ไงครับพระเจ้าเนี่ย He said that nowadays people not do it like this way this is a original yeah what people do is just put in the what you call the bowl in the pot yeah that's it because they don't know the temperature they don't know how to deal with the heat and the bamboo right And, and that's you know that's the thing with many things, but the thing is is that people are becoming lazier. Any pie, a c o k i n the salty, it's a tuna fish, but it's a Thai fish. I don't know what it's called. It's salty. And what is that? I need a bit of salt. My s a t n I know, but do you know the name of it? Yeah. Okay. So If you know the name, we'll, we'll look it up and translate it. Or you can use a tamarind. Or tamarind. So you mix this. He said, put this for make all the ingredients together and not itchy. So then you take that stuff that was pounded, the lemongrass and all that stuff, and mix it in with the fish. Yeah. And this is going to be the chili p e p p e r Okay. So then, after it's cooked, you're gonna take those leaves and mix it in with that. Where does it? Where does it? This is when it's go down. Then it cook. You put it. Oh, okay, okay. Make a smooth one. Cut pick cut. Cut pick cut. Cut pick cut. Yeah, Macquan. He said it's look like a spicy thing. Look like a pepper. Hmm. Well, let me tell you, you guys can't smell it, but just smelling all this stuff, it smells really, really nice. You're getting that aroma from all these herbs. It is just oh, so good. Now, a spa with herb. <laughs> yeah, but let me tell you. For me to eat it, it has to be delicious, and it is out of this world. It is very, very good. Copper leaves. Copper leaves. Yes, got it. Very good. Smell good. Mmm, that smells. That smells really good. So right now, a little fire is going to be started so that the stuff can be cooked in that bamboo that was stuffed in there. And look at this. This is really amazing. There was just a little bit of smoke. Nobody's tending to it. Nothing. It's just sitting there. No. What? No. No. But your mom started it, and there's just a little bit of smoke. And look at it. There's the fire. Oh yeah. Yeah. The, There's the fire. You thought I was joking? No. That's impressive. For me to start a fire, it takes five liters of gasoline, three boxes of matches. Wow, that is amazing. You put the bamboo. It, does it take? Does it take any water or anything inside of there? No, no water. Oh, so then the fire will create its own. Moisture inside. The o m a n t a p e n a m for the o m a n t a n come. Yeah, the bond leaf. You create. She said, you need to be a little bit of the fire. If it's too much, this bamboo will burn. Don't have on on. He said it's very hard to make. 
Because why? Because very hard to make so many. The time when you do this is people just don't like to be waiting. Hmm. Yeah, that's one of the that's one of the things of today's society is everything quick. That's why you have fast food places mm. quick. And one of the good things about cooking with wood is the mosquitoes don't get you. He said, sending to America, I said, the whole world will know. Mm -hmm. And you sleep it, but then make it burn in one mm. And you keep rotating it. And he keeps cooking it until what? It gets soft or something? Yeah, when it gets soft, you put a piece of tape. And then he used this wood to mix it up. Okay. Hey, this is the bondi. You just have to have access to bamboo. Mm-hmm. Mm. You can see the bubbling. You can see the. He said, "Be careful when it's very hot." It can explode and hit your face. Mm -hmm. Be careful. He said, oh it's happening for... Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, but look at the sizzling of that. He said, that's why that he put the bamboo stick here uh -huh. for make uh, a little bit of the area, the space. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. the air inside, the heat, uh, it, it can out. That's right. So the gases don't get trapped down there. Mm-hmm. And it's not too much uh, pressure. Mm. Mm -hmm. If not, the all the pressure from the heat, it will explode. And as time goes on, you keep rotating it. And Let you move know. it up and down to concentrate the heat in different places. And then at some point, that stick will push those leaves down and the rest of the stuff will be added. Okay. So now you take the stick. And because that stick has little notches, it acts like a serrated knife and cuts as it pushes down and you continue to cook. Except now, yeah, you're going to add the water buffalo skin and that will give you some protein. Yeah, it'll give you some uh, some oil, some fat. You put the chili yeah. paste. Now you put the chili paste, the fish, all that stuff goes in there now. And the sour leaf. Yeah, yeah, all, all that stuff. Oh, the... the sour leaf. Now the sour leaf is getting stuffed in there. And it will also act as a plug, I, I imagine. Okay, and as you're going along, you keep feeding these little sticks in there to keep the fire going, but not at a very high heat. And the majority of the fire is going on the lower to the third. Okay, so now it's cooked for a while. You're taking the serrated uh, piece of bamboo and you're pushing in and out, mixing and allowing everything to move around. And let me tell you, the smell is fantastic. You can really smell with the stuff in there. As you can see, the water continues to be cooked out of the bamboo. See the color it changed. It used to be green. Yeah, 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 that's, that's true. So as you can see, things are cooking because the color is changing. Make it with a bamboo stick. Now the stick is going in and out very easily. So that means everything is softening up. And it's going all the way down to the bottom. Everything is compacting down. He said right now, 
is a time that if you gonna shake it, taste it. If you want to put more salt, uh, more salt, more chili. Mm. Right now is the time to do it. Right now, low of the heat. The heat. Use charcoal instead to a high. Mm. So this is a low to medium heat mm. on the outdoor stove setting. Yeah. <laughs> number one, number two. Yeah, you set it on number one, number two fire setting. Good, let me see. So here it is, very good. We just gave it a test taste and it is fantastic. It's hard to believe that all these things that are growing out by the river, behind the shed, down the road, just everywhere, can turn into something like this. It is delicious. And it's really unfortunate that the world is more and more turning to canned food, frozen food, processed food. We need to go back to the natural, organic type of food where you don't add all this junk to it and we would be a hell of a lot healthier. This is fantastic. And you can hear that thing boiling. And here he's got some papaya leaves. And according to what he said, you can actually burn them down a little bit and eat them. Okay, a little bit more mixing. Mmm. Okay. Okay. Finish. Okay. Yep. All right. So now. So now it's coming out of the tube. Tomorrow you can reheat it again. Okay. So the remainder is staying in the tube to be reheated tomorrow. Okay. Oh, very good. Yeah, I tasted it. It's very good. And here's a close-up of the stuff. Everything <laughs> is just a paste. He's very good. Thanks for watching. See you next time. See you. Bye bye.